This past summer, I got to meet Marquez Brownlee. Marquez is a tech YouTuber also known as MKBHD, and he has over 15 million subscribers on YouTube. He's interviewed Kobe Bryant, Bill Gates, Barack Obama, Elon Musk, and he's been a guest on Hot Ones. And when he's not making YouTube videos, he plays on a professional Ultimate Frisbee team in the American Ultimate Disc League. His team's called the New York Empire, and I found out that their home games were actually played really close to where I used to live, so I decided to go to one. And tickets were only like $10. The whole experience experience was pretty wild. The stadium was like the size of a small high school football stadium, but it was packed. There were people hyping the crowd up, like throwing out free merch and promotional items. There was this incredible drum line there. And the whole time I was kind of trying to figure out like who these fans were. Like there were definitely some parents of players that were there, but there was also a priest there and the guy next to me was wearing like over ear headphones and reading a book the whole time. But there were also people there that were just like legitimate fans of the sport. They were talking about how they were playing ultimate earlier that day. They knew all the players names and they were wearing merch from the teams that were playing. To be honest, that's a segment of the population that I just didn't know existed. Anyways, the game was exciting and it was super cool to get to see Marquez play. He's really Really tall, really athletic, and the game actually went into double overtime. So the New York Empire won in sudden death, 24 to 23 over the Raleigh Flyers. And the Empire survived 24-23. And after the game, players just kind of walked over to their friends and family and fans that were there. So I got to go and walk up to Marquez. We said, what's up? I told him that I was excited about the new YouTube channel he was launching because he was just about to start his secondary channel, which is called The Studio. He was appreciative of that. And then he signed to this Frisbee I had brought and we got this super grainy picture together. So that was really cool. It looked like there were a bunch of other people there just to see him. And even though he was tired from the game, he took time to get pictures and sign autographs with all of them. So to me, he came across exactly like he does in his video. Is just really even keeled, super cool guy to be around. I'm really glad that I got the chance to meet him. If you want to see Marquez play or just support your local team, the AUDL season kicks off on April 29th. Let me know in the comments what YouTuber or internet celebrity you'd be most excited to meet. And in a future video, I'll tell you about the time that I almost met Dude Perfect. So make sure you're subscribed so you don't miss out on that video. But until then, just remember that even when it doesn't feel like it, it's going to be okay. I'll see you soon. Broke my ankle.